Change that. And joining us now is the head coach at Ole Miss, Lane Kiffin. Always pleased to have him join us right before games from the field. So, Lane, I mentioned earlier, a chance to have the first 11 win season in Ole Miss history. As you continue to elevate this program, what's the significance of, of reaching a milestone like that? Well, that would be amazing. This, this is a great opportunity today to be playing in this stadium. It's one of the top teams and programs in the country. Coach Franklin has done a great job with it. So that would be amazing to accomplish in a feat of the most wins in school history with all the great coaches and players that have been here before us. So, Lane, good stuff on the football. But I, I, how come you're not back there with Juice? How come you're not holding the leash there and giving Juice some TV time? He's in the background. That's all we see. It's on oh, your left. Right, that's, there a, you that's a good question. So, Juice usually doesn't make the road games, <laughs> but... The Peach Bowl actually requested him to come. And then I just had did an ESPN go. radio interview, and they said, what about Herb Street's dog and Juice in a one-on-one -on -one matchup? Oh, I yeah. Said, I think we kind of got he, that I one. I think, I think we kind of got that off the line of scrimmage. We're yeah. kind of more of a man-to-man, yeah. -man, like, we're not really a zone dog. I feel like your dog I got, more I got a, a green player. dot middle linebacker. He's more green dot middle linebacker. <laughs> hey, old school 80s like box middle linebacker is what I got with Ben. I like that. But he's a thinker. Like old school yeah. 80s Big Ten football. You know, yeah, versus exactly. Yeah, exactly. Down here. <laughs> Juice is absolutely crushing it, as are you. We talked earlier in the season, and we talked about how you're glowing, Coach, you know? Seems like that has continued. Way to go. Looking healthier than ever at the end of a football season. Seems like it's been a great one for you. I got a chance to listen to your press conference where you compared you and Penn State being very similar, losing to two great teams. Uh, kind of looking at it the same way. What do you see from this Penn State team, and how do you feel about your squad going into this bowl game? Well, I, I think there are some similarities with both teams having two losses to two of the top, you know, six, seven teams in the country. So, um, but none of that matters today. These guys have great players. It's the number one defense in the country, statistically by far. And so everybody struggled against them. So this will be a big challenge today, one that we're excited to be part of. Coach, we have a team like Penn State and the, their D.C. isn't there. Two of their top defenders aren't there. What does it take to get your guys to still stay motivated to play a team like this, who's a great team, but they're missing a lot of pieces? Well, I, I don't think they're missing that many pieces. I see some really good-looking guys down there in warm-ups. <laughs> so um, our, our guys are very motivated. I think a key to the game whenever you've had long layoffs like this is taking care of the ball and coming out really fast after not playing for a while and tackling really well. Hey, hey, hey Lane, real quick on the Rose Bowl, Michigan, Alabama, you broke down a lot of Penn State film. You've seen Michigan. You know Alabama inside and out. What, what do you, who do you think wins out here? Well, I wasn't ready for that question. Um, <laughs> I mean, those are two great teams, two great coaches. But I mean, come on, Herb Street, that's a setup. So, come on, roll tide. Hey, I was giving you a chance, Twitter, Twitter Lane Kiffin, to just stay right here, stay in here, man. Lane, Lane is sneaky old school. Yeah. Didn't want the in-helmet communication yeah. for this game. Yeah. Not going to make the pick. You know, you're gonna, Lane, wish you luck we in this game that, coming Lane. up. Looking young Looking too. Looking forward to seeing your team. Nice pick. All right, guys, have a good one. Have a good New Year.